Hello everybody, my name is Chris Wood. I am 51 years old and I am a revenge retaliation full physical identity theft victim. For almost five years from Lennox and Eddington, Ontario Provincial Police. From Bill Woldridge, a guy named Bill Woldridge lives at 149 Center Street, North Napanee, now bald glasses. Sometimes a goatee, for approximately 65 to 70 years old. Frequents a place downtown, a local pub, and a coffee place. Also Tim Hortons as well. Blair Frederick Hardy, Tyler Lake, Jason Van Alstyne, Dale Hartwick, Tony Hearns are guilty of identity thefts and frauds, financial thefts and frauds, aiding OPP in this crime for four years, skull splitting, brain injuring, lung and kidney damage, body mutilations while being lied about, being prevented from medical help through false charging from the police and criminal negligent doctors who are accessories to co-commit and cover up OPP crimes and the ones named. I spoke their human trafficking, their sex slavery trafficking and other crimes as a result. I got shot with something back in 2019 by XOPP chief or commander before leaving in Napanee. He drove a white Jeep Wrangler. It was on the corner of Center and Bridge Street. Him and somebody in a black truck. They I, they pulled up at the stoplights. They pointed something, shot it, and it went into my right ear. I started having problems. I go to the hospital. I get files falsified. Medical treatment refusals. Lies. Cover-ups. Being falsely arrested to prevent theirs in an attempt to criminalize me, in an attempt to get away with what they're guilty of. I am the end of my bloodline, so congratulations to the hospitals and OPP, Spencer Mills 14716, Robert Kane 7224, Spencer, or ex-chief or commander, year 2019, staff sergeants, years 2019, 2021, kidnapping, sodomy, sex assault, Shannon Cork, Robert Lucas, Stacy, a mental health worker, was an Ebony Daily Tea Company, now Kingston, left to further distance herself in hopes of deniability, and also Shelly Hafner, Hafner had me kidnapped May 27, 2021, congratulations, this is done, it could all be medically proven, time has been bought, the lies, time buying, cover-ups, arrest, refusals, false arrest, the stalking, having my mother murdered, having my dogs killed, while well, having me blamed for this and having me medically blacklisted and kept from help to buy time and get away with this. OPP are guilty of causing homelessness. This is how they are trafficking, framing, and committing murders above suspicion with these low-life stalkers, gang stalkers, and killers who are doing this with and for them. It is being done to me by what is called remote narrow monitoring. I have had it on me since, and also OPP are putting prisoner tracking on their victims. No criminal record or history, no psychological record or history. Regardless of the lies and bullshit that these bastards are telling against me to be above suspicion to get away. Families are murdered or missing natives. I would check Ontario Provincial Police, especially ones around Lennox and Addington, LNA, OPP. They are very seriously dangerous and corrupt.